if Nadia eats dinner here <laughs> and puts a photo up on her Instagram, her mother texts or calls straight away and says, not as good as mine. <laughs> How was it? Not that good? <laughs> she always gets so jealous. But yeah, she's like, how is that? Like, mejor que el mío. My name is Raf Rashid and we're at my home in Brunswick West. For 25 years, I've thought that tacos came out of a yellow box. Ondo Paso makes great Mexican cooks. Olé! I remember when mum came home for the first time and she's like, oh, tonight we're trying tacos. And I was like, oh, tacos, can't wait. Me and my brother, we were so pumped. All I knew was there was this, a corn chip that was hard and you stuffed it with mincemeat, lettuce, tomato, and cheese. At first, crunch, crunch was just, it was mind blowing. It was all over Australia, all through the 80s, all through the 90s. Every week we would have tacos. Now, authentic, inauthentic, whichever way you want to look at it, they were all fantastic to me. I got my good friend Nadia coming through, Nadia Hernandez, is that right? Oh, like Hernandez, but like <laughs> Nadia Hernandez. <laughs> Sorry, Nadia is from Venezuela. <laughs> Nadia is an artist. Me and Becky have bought lots of her art over the years and it's super colorful and a bit dark. Yeah, it's like quite political. Behind all the initial color is like a lot of personal stories. Get people in and then reveal the rest. <laughs> <laughs> I wanted Nadia to come on because you guys mess with the masa. We mess with the masa for sure. Yeah. Yeah. And we've had lots of tacos together. Yes, we have. The most tacos that I've eaten in this house have been with you. Yeah. So, so we got taco history. Yes. Well, like you said, I'm from Venezuela, but we don't make tacos. We make arepas. We, so we mess with the masa in that way. But we moved to Tucson when I was like nine and I swear my mom used to make these tacos with yeah. the shells, with the iceberg and the cheese. It's so dope. Yeah, and I used to like get home from swim practice and be like, yes. I think that's what came to Australia was a Tex-Mex. Now I'm like, okay, cool. How can we take the Tex-Mex but make it Melbourne Mex? Yeah. Mel Mex. Mel Mex. Yes, that's what we're doing. Her Mexi Melby. <laughs> Her Mexi. Yeah. All right. Um, <laughs> I wanted to keep it simple and fast, you know? Yeah, I and tortillas, I think we should make them. They're so easy to make. Avocado, coriander, masa flour, iceberg, cumin, Mexican oregano, cheese, tin tomatoes, diced, garlic, eggplant, apple cider vinegar, limes, and some salt. First, we're gonna make this salsa. Sounds good. Okay, canned tomatoes. Salt. Nice. Get a one garlic clove. You should use a garlic press for this. What we want to happen is just for the tomatoes to sort of marinate in garlic. Mm. And then you just want to leave this for kind of a few hours. If you've only got half an hour, then half an hour it is, okay? Yeah. A little bit of lime juice, olive oil. Okay. And that's your salsa. This is my salsa. So good. I'm telling you, I'm telling you. I'm gonna make the masa, on. right? The masa, yes. Okay, I'm gonna start cutting this. Um, put some water in there and start mixing it together until it's like, until it feel, yeah, until it feels right. Until okay. it feels right. Yeah, so just you, you just work it until it comes together. Yep. Um, and you can add a little bit more, or you can add a bit more water, whichever you, you know what it's supposed to feel like. I think I know what it's. Maybe. I think it's, I think it's yeah. in your blood. It's, it's in my it's, blood. Um, <laughs> I'm gonna put this eggplant into the pan. I don't know, we can try pressing one out. This okay. is pretty good. Cool. If you don't have a tortilla press at home yet, just roll them out mm. or... Um, yeah, now let's have a look. How's it feeling? Moment of truth. Oh, so good. Hey, it's in my blood. <laughs> you want it so it doesn't crack. You want it like this, you know? I think tacos are the greatest dish for a house party. Yeah, you can like eat and then while you're eating you can, you know, you can put on the tunes, you can dance. Yeah. I'm always kind of like... Oh yeah, Nadia is <laughs> mad for the dancing. Yeah. <laughs> but you get that dance face like... <laughs> I know. I'm like, what? Is yeah. she mad at me? Yeah. And it's just like... <sighs> Yeah, I'm like eating the taco with like the reggaeton in the background. Oh, reggaeton. Like... She's mad for the reggaeton. <laughs> Every time. <laughs> 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 
What is that song? Oh, uh, like, it's this song. It's so good. It's like a really, really old track, but it's called El Gato Volador, which just means like the flying cat. Yeah, that's right. The and it's flying just cat. like these guys, and they're just El like, gato El what? Gato Volador. <laughs> that looks like someone who's enjoying themselves. I just think people would get scared if they walked into yeah. the kitchen and I was rocking it like. <laughs> um, if Nadia has the tunes going, if the face gets a I little, it's it. a little stank. Like. <laughs> and then if we've got the tacos going, it's just perfect. It's happiness. It's perfect. Yeah, it's, it's like happiness. Pure That's, joy. Yeah. <laughs> these are looking good. Thank you. Check these out, right? Like they're soft. Yeah. Um, um, but I don't want them falling apart because I want them to soak up flavor from this little vinegar mix that we did. Ah, so I'm yeah, just going to pop them straight in there. Apple cider vinegar, olive oil, cumin, and Mexican oregano. That so, smells amazing. This is going to be That cool. is, I'm going to do this. Please. I'm going to make this. I want everyone to make this. You know what I like about the taco? What's up? You can like, it's kind of like choosing an outfit every day. You know, you can like, Change it up. Putting some cheese in this dough would pop it. I think it would pop it. Yeah, you're gonna go hard. I'm just gonna go hard on the okay, cheese. Okay. Yeah. I mean, you know, someone's going, that's not a tortilla now. There's authenticity, you know? Yeah. Um, and I struggle with this all the time. It's like, okay, cool. Well, how, <laughs> where, where, where do we fit in? I believe in this and this has cheese in it. I am really excited about the cheese tortilla. Good. So these are just going into nonstick pan and they cook really quick. Okay, let's see if we can cook these cheese. You can hear the cheese already yeah. sizzling. Well, this could be what's up. Mm. Oh man, feel that. Whoa, bro. oh my God, that's nice. This is gonna be real delicious, like super good. It's a little, it's a little doughy. Yeah, it's so good. Oh, were you looking for a high five? Or? No, no, I was, no, I was just like <laughs> excited. I love the iceberg. Yeah, I think it's perfect for this. Do you think it's making a comeback? Um, iceberg resurgence? Yeah, why not? <laughs> do you want me to do anything? No. Um, I can do the avocado. Oh, Raph, do you remember that one time that I brought the camarones, like the prawns on the plane? Yes. <laughs> that was like a taco experience. Yeah. Like that is town. one of those people that if we're in the same town, <laughs> we'll just see Nadia for a couple of hours. So yeah. you come through the hotel and we'll hang. Yeah. And I brought... But you bought some prawns that you <laughs> came from Brisbane yeah. that were in a little box. Yeah. And I had the tortillas as yes, well. And yes. I was just like making my own prawn yes. tacos in the hotel yes. room. Yes. That's why we're doing this today. Yeah. I think we just put... Ah! I know, <laughs> I know, I know, it's weird. Oh, I don't know. There's it's something cool. about cheese melting, right? Your shoulders will relax. Yeah! Oh, you I know, felt... lean into it. We've got some melted cheese. Yeah. It needs to be slightly crispy, so you'll get that here. People are still polarized by coriander. I love, do you, well, obviously you love coriander. I love it. And it looks pretty. We made tacos. <laughs> Hey. <laughs> oh, that is as cheese as I can get. <laughs> the color and the um, the form is reminiscent of what I grew up with mm. in the 80s. But we are now on a new track. I mm. can't wait to try it. Uh, mm. Yum. Yum. The vinegar, like, is just it's super good with the eggplant. Mm, that's just great. <laughs> and cheese. Um, <laughs> You know, homemade tortillas, they've got way more body than anything you buy at the store. Mm. I was just going to say that, like the first thing you taste is the eggplant and then like that, is that your Is that your grip? <laughs> That's fucking deep, man. That's like, like right around. Is that how you grip? Shit, man. I don't like... No, this is like a taco claw. Oh, oh, oh. Yeah. <laughs> you know, and then you have the plate, like get into it. Well, that is really yum. Mm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> ah, thank you. <laughs> oh. <laughs>